You're put here on this earth to be more than just a drug addict. Yo, yo, yo. CPA Strength here, back again with another video. <clears throat> on my morning walk today, the main message of this video is you are here to be more than just a drug addict. I don't know who this message needs to hit to today, but I just was thinking about this a lot today. I'm on my morning walk. I go on this morning walk every day. Um, you see there's my office over there with the flowers on it. So I walk across this bridge uh, over there. I want you to know that you are put here on this earth to be more than just a drug addict. Why do I say that? Because I think that about myself all the time. For 20 years, that's all I did. That was my only goal in life, to be a drug addict. Albeit, I hustled to make my money and I wasn't even good at that because all I wanted to do, because once I had a bunch of bunch of drugs and money, I wouldn't answer my phone. I would just get high. That's all I wanted to do to escape my mindset because I hated myself so much. That's the only way I could escape it. Instead of dealing with why I hated myself, I would do the drugs to escape. You're just so much more than that though. I think about all the all the stuff I go through, growing my business, having a, a YouTube channel with hundreds, uh, at this point a couple hundred thousand subscribers. I don't know, going on, going on bike rides, seeing things, you know, having, saving up for a car, buying a, buying a car that can drive around and uh, just visit visit friends and things. We turn, in, turn it into a, a motivational speaker. Just doing basically anything I do in my life. You know, getting a college degree, getting a CPA license. You know, none of that would have been, none of that would have been possible if I just continued to smoke meth. You know, if I just continued to do heroin, to do Roxy Cottons, to keep drinking alcohol, none of this would have been possible. I would have died. Nobody would know anything about me other than I was a drug addict. No one really even would have been like, oh, we had a bunch of, he had a bunch of wasted potential. Nah. I said, nah, he was just, he was just a drug addict, man. That's it. That's it. That's it. I don't know why, but that message is really on me today about all the goals I have, everything like that going forward in my life. None of that would have been possible if I was a drug addict. I would have just been a drug addict. That's it. That's it. How sad. That's all my life was, was a drug addict. I probably, I don't know how long I would have lived. I mean, I guess I would have overdosed at some point. Do you know many old, when I started doing heavy drugs when I was 15 years old, Drinking, drugging, anything I could find my, anything I could get my hands on to black out because I hated myself so much. I'm just so happy that something sparked inside of me and I wanted more for my life and I started doing more and you can do more too. You're in this, this, this rabbit hole. You don't know how you're going to get out because the only thing that makes you feel better for a little bit is doing the drugs. I understand that. I did it for 20 years. I'm not here to say, oh, I mean, this video is not for how you're gonna get yourself out of it. If, if you wanna hear more or anything, just drop a comment. I just kinda wanna give someone who is in the thick of it right now, in the thick of doing, uh, in the thick of being a drug addict, you know, it was really hard for me was when I stopped drinking after about a year, 
I have almost 10 years of no drinking. For me, that's what I said. I'm quitting drinking, that's it. I'm quitting drinking. That's the only thing I said I'm quitting and it changed my life because I can't handle, I can't handle drinking because I drink to black out. Once I start drinking, then I want all the other hard drugs and everything else is out the window. Things weren't happening fast enough. You know how they say like things don't happen on your time, they happen on God's time? Things weren't happening fast enough for me. I would get kind of upset about that. Whether you're right now in the throes of addiction or you're, you know, you've stopped, you're, you're, you're going through it, you, you're, you're, it's hard, things aren't changing for you. Let me just tell you, anything that you do after you stop doing the drugs, being a drug addict, whatever you do, you wouldn't have achieved if you were just a drug addict. I'll just go with me. If I were to stay doing drugs, if I were to stay doing meth, Oxycontins, heroin, Xanax bars, anything I get my fucking hands on, crack, coke, anything, anything to black out, to numb the pain. If I would've kept doing that, you know where I would be? I would be dead, I'd be still going that, and they say, what about JD? I wouldn't be no CPA strength. What about JD? What about Jonathan? He's a fucking drug addict, man. That's it. Fucking drug addict. No. Man, I can't pull himself up from fucking nothing, bro. From shit. Didn't have shit. No one believed in him. Not one motherfucking person ever believed in him. Pulled him up by the bootstraps. Got himself a fucking college degree. Went to community college. Got himself a got himself a fucking college degree. Studied his ass off against all odds. Became one of the 500,000 CPAs in the fucking America. Started his own fucking business. Got it up to over six figures. And I ain't stopping there. It's not about the money, but I finally got my business over 100,000. And now I want 200,000. Got a real estate license. All that shit too that they told me, they told me you can't do that. You got a record, you'll never do that. Guess what, I fucking did it. Did all that shit. Started a YouTube channel. Oh, little old me, started a fucking YouTube channel. Now I got over 200,000 people. I'm gonna have a million one day. Better believe it, baby. What else? I'm gonna be a fucking homeowner. I'm gonna have a fucking podcast. All that shit. Who knows what else? I'm gonna be a master gardener. All that stuff. So many goals and aspirations. I inspire people, I motivate people, all that shit. Because I stopped doing drugs. If I would have stayed doing drugs, I would have just been a fucking drug addict. How fucking pathetic. You're put on this fucking world for more than just being a fucking drug addict. That's about all I got for today. Uh, that was just heavy on my mind. And I'm gonna start doing more stuff like this on my morning walk, stuff that I think about. Have a blessed day, and just remember, you're put here on this earth to be more than just a drug addict. I wholeheartedly believe that, deuces.